Freedom. Now available in paperback and e-readers. John Haynes, Illuminati, a man who rules the world, takes on the head of the global elite in this all-new action-packed John Haynes series adventure. Get your copy of John Haynes, Illuminati in paperback and e-readers at Amazon.com and online booksellers everywhere. You often have these leftists who want to believe that they can save Pookie. And it's leftists like this who want to believe that they can save Pookie who go out and create dysfunctional policies like bail reform, believing that if they give Pookie a chance, he will change. Unfortunately, when it comes to Pookie, there's no chance of him changing, and there's no chance of him changing due to the dysfunctional way he is raised in a single mother household. Now, many people want to wait until a Pookie gets older until when they want to fix him. However, the problem started with this boy when he was born inside of that single mother household. And I talk about this in depth in my book, The Man Crisis, because the road to a boy becoming a pookie, or as I call them under the clinical term, beta male, is in that single mother household. And in that single mother household, this is where all the problems start with the pookie. And they all start with the pookie primarily because the first teacher of that boy starts teaching him dysfunction from minute one. And because the women who raise Pookie are too proud to admit that they need the help of a man, what happens with Pookie is that he doesn't start out life learning the proper male life skills or male survival skills to navigate life in the world. And as this boy is raised in that single mother household or that divorced household or that household with a beta male father, what happens to that boy is instead of that boy seeing natural male life skills modeled for him like a man going to work or a man going out here and participating in natural male habits, what that boy learns are female life skills and learns how to navigate the world the way a woman navigates the world. And the way a woman navigates and survives in the world is completely different than a man. A woman oftentimes looks to get her needs met by men and looks to make herself appear attractive to men. However, a man has to survive in the world because he is the only one who can take care of himself and as he looks to take care of himself, he learns a hard lesson early on that the world is hard, the world is rough, and that he has to build a discipline and resolve in order to survive in the world. And Pookie never gets those lessons when he's young because he, one, doesn't see a man persevering like his father would do when he goes to work in the face of all of that adversity and competition. And two, he doesn't see a man going out here and modeling manhood for him, showing him an example of a man working with his work ethic and his discipline and working towards building something. He doesn't see men in his life working. And because he doesn't see that modeled for him, he takes the woman's role and believes that this is normal, but this is dysfunctional because the world, again, isn't going to treat him the same way it would treat a woman. And what happens to Pookie is as he's raised in that home, learning these female life skills, what further exacerbates the whole situation is that this woman basically turns this boy from a son into a son husband. And in that codependent relationship he has with that mother, what that mother does is spoil and coddle this boy. And as she spoils and coddles this boy, what happens to this boy is that he doesn't learn how to function in the world. No, he doesn't learn the life skills that he needs to function in the world, like critical thinking, the ability to use logic and reason, the ability to problem solve, because mom solves all his problems for him. Mom does all his thinking for him. Mom goes out here, and as she's out here, she 
reacts to him emotionally and that teaches him how to be emotional and as he grows up in that home with a woman or a divorced woman or a beta male father he doesn't learn the life skills that he's going to need to navigate life and this really basically it starts Pookie on the road to dysfunction and as he's on that road to dysfunction he is as he enters adolescence he's further enabled by other women in his life like his girlfriend and as he go, grows older he winds up in these codependent relationships not learning how to function interdependently in the world because a man has to learn how to function in the world interdependently he has to understand he as he's responsible for himself he's not only responsible for taking care of his needs first he also has to take care of the needs of others and that is how he develops his leadership skills unfortunately with Pookie he never learns to develop leadership skills and instead what happens to Pookie is he becomes a follower like the woman he was raised by and the woman he is dating and he as he learns how to follow women he what he does is he doesn't know how to meet his own needs and this is what puts Pookie on the road to him participating in antisocial and criminal behavior because the foundation for Pookie being out here and participating in antisocial and criminal behavior is because he doesn't, one, know his role as a man, does not know his purpose as a man in God's order, does not know how to lead himself in God's order, does not ha understand his purpose as a man, and he's trying to get his needs met by women, hoping that women will go out and give him things and this is where he winds up on a really rough road because when it comes to a man a woman is not going to give you things no she's expecting you to give her things and Pookie as he's in this world coddled and spoiled by this mother he, he has to go out into the world where people are expecting him to one take responsibility for himself to take the lead as related to the direction in his life three go out here and be able to set course for himself people are expecting him to meet the standards of manhood but he can't meet the standards of manhood because he was raised by a woman and because he was raised by a woman he's expecting the world to take care of him the same way that a woman is taken care of by a man but men aren't expecting that of him no they're expecting him to carry his own weight and as he runs into men because his mother basically went out here and was denouncing men and calling men all kinds of names he's basically he's out here thinking that he he's out here thinking that they're going to sit there and deal with him the same way but no men are expecting a man to one carry his own weight and to show another man respect but he doesn't learn how to respect the authority of men, respect the leadership of men, respect the rules and boundaries of men, and he comes at men as adversaries, and as he comes at men as adversaries because he sees men beneath him, what he does is alienate men who would want to teach him male life skills and survival skills as they're working with him, and this makes it where Pookie is a person who was going to have a hard time in life because the world for men again is different than it is for women and men expect men to follow the man code and be able to follow the unwritten social rules of the man code which is taught by every boy by his father and his brothers and other men there's a code that men are taught but Pookie isn't taught and since Pookie isn't taught he's getting in the face of men that he's gonna need for support and help and guidance and he alienates those men and as he alienates those men he further keeps himself from getting his needs met and he prevents himself from as he get presents himself from getting his needs met what happens to Pookie is he starts to get frustrated because he can't do the things that he wants and because he can't do the things that he wants this is what puts Pookie on a road to antisocial behavior and looking to, to just get attention and looking to start committing crimes and as he's doing this 
he is not learning that he has to take responsibility for himself and humble himself to work with other men. No, he's out here because he learned pride from his mother. What he does is take that pride he learned from his mother and go out here and think he can act out the way he did with mama, not understanding that the world sees him differently as a man than a woman. And if he acts, and if a woman acts out, maybe there will be some simps who will try to pacify her. But when it comes to a man, there is nobody who's going to pacify you. No, when it comes to the world of men, when a man acts out, a man will have to deal with consequences. And that's where Pookie starts to have problems in the real world as he runs into men and male authority figures. As Pookie runs into men and male authority figures in his adolescence, he runs into problems because he runs into consequences. And as he runs into consequences, what starts is a downward spiral because Pookie has already been hardwired with dysfunctional values, dysfunctional habits that he learned from single mom. And there's no real way to correct that behavior. And that's where people get it twisted about Pookie. They get it twisted because they think they can fix him in adolescence, but you cannot fix Pookie in adolescence or young adulthood because he's already hardwired with the teachings that his mother taught him. And those habits basically are instilled with him and cannot be, bro cannot be fixed. And that's where everybody, especially these leftists, get it twisted. When it comes to Pookie, they get it twisted because they think, oh, we can help him when he's older. No, you can't help him when he's older because he's already hard set with dysfunction. And because he's hard set with dysfunction, there is no way to fix this male at this point. This male at this point is basically damaged and you'll have folks on the left thinking, oh, you can help him, but there's no helping him at that point because at this point, he doesn't really, he's just stuck in one gear. And again, he's still trying to make the world work the way it does for women, that it does for men, but it doesn't work that way at all. And that's where Pookie winds up getting in a jam because he's got this, this whole process of reacting on his emotions and his feelings instead of learning how to critically think and learning how to critically think in a way that will make the world work for him as a man. He doesn't learn this at all. And again, this is why you have all of these dysfunctional policies like bail reform and them failing because Pookie doesn't know how to take responsibility for himself. And that's where the whole policy of bail reform fell apart because you're expecting someone who was raised to never take responsibility for themselves to go out and actively take responsibility for themselves. Because if a boy is not raised to take responsibility for himself and talk about rules and structure from a father and a mother, then there's no way you can get that boy to learn how to function and navigate life as related to seeing the second chance that is put in front of him with this bail reform. That's what many of the politicians don't understand about Pookie. Pookie basically can't take responsibility for himself because Mama never taught him to take care of responsibility for himself because he's been coddled and spoiled in that son-husband relationship. And as this boy has been coddled and spoiled in this son-husband relationship, this boy never learns that he has to take ownership for himself and take responsibility for himself. So if he were to get arrested in a majority of cases, what he's going to do is go out and see it as an opportunity to commit more crimes. And as he sees it as an opportunity to commit more crimes, what he's going to do instead of showing um, appreciation for, for the release is he's going to go out and show his contempt by committing more crimes. Moreover, he's not going to show up for his court date because he's never learned to respect male authority or institutions of male authority like the courts 
or respect male authority like law enforcement. That's where everybody gets it twisted about Pookie. I mean, people get it twisted about Pookie. And as they look to so-called help Pookie, what they do is enable more of his dysfunctional behavior. And they enable more of his dysfunctional behavior because we have a more and more growing gynocentric political system. And this gynocentric political system of women basically want to try to protect their sons. But when they go out and try to protect their sons, all they do is further enable dysfunction in these boys who grow up to become even more dysfunctional men. And as they grow up to become more dysfunctional men, the help ironically winds up hindering them. And it winds up hindering them because these boys don't learn about concepts that they should have learned about when they were younger, like boundaries, learn about concepts like respecting male authority and male authority figures, learn about concepts like showing respect for others and learning about concepts like learning how to navigate through your emotions and learning how to, while you have feelings, you don't act on them because there are consequences. These are things that these boys did not learn because they grew up inside of the single mother household. And as they grew up in the single mother household, we have a lot of these leftist politicians who want to talk about helping Pookie, but there's no way they can help Pookie with this approach because the time to help Pookie was when he was younger by making sure that his father remained in his life, making sure that he learned about the world of life from men, investing in that boy when he was younger so that when he grew up to become a man, he would learn about his role as a head, a role as a leader, a role as a, as a steward in God's order, a role as somebody who is responsible to God and accountable to God. The time to deal with a boy is when he's young. And King David told us this in his Psalms to train up a child in the way he should go so that when he's older, he will not depart from it. Unfortunately, in the West, American people walked away from God and supported feminism, which told us that a woman could raise a boy to become a man. But we see that when you go out and socially engineer a boy to become this kinder, gentler, softer beta male, we get a male who is not someone who can take responsibility for himself and a male who cannot take responsibility for himself basically becomes a man who's not capable of taking responsibility for himself and not capable of taking responsibility for his role as a man, excuse me, as a leader, as an authority figure. And this frustrates many of the women who have to get involved with Pookie and they're looking for him to be a man, but there's no fixing a broken man because once you break that man and as related to his rearing process in the early stages, there's no way to fix it in most cases unless there are male figures there who can show this boy the way he needs to go. I mean, if you don't train up the boy to become a man, what you get is a pookie. And again, a pookie is a broken man, defective at the factory source with the mother, defective at the factory source. And you'll have many women out here thinking they can help fix this man. No, you can't fix that man at that point because he's already hard programmed with code. And as he's hard programmed with code, there is no way for you to fix that man. And that's why I have the philosophy of as is. As you see this man is how he will be. And he is who he is based on what the mother has instilled in him. And that's where many of the pookies have the problem. And you'll have women saying that they can help him, but there's no way you can help him at that point. Moreover, you can have all the programs out here and policies like bail reform, but they will not work. And they will not work because the, pro the place to fix the boy was at his early age because the person who got a dysfunctional instruction manual, the mother, the first teacher, taught him dysfunction. And if he learns dysfunction, 
and there's no men there to intervene to teach him proper ways to move as a man, you're not going to get a man, you're going to get a dysfunctional male who's going to have defects and issues, and you're going to have women who will later on in his life and trying to fix him, you'll have criminal justice system trying to fix him, and again, not being able to fix him because the code he was wired with is, is, is filled with malicious software in some cases because some women want to get back at the baby father, others are not really taught enough about how to raise boys to understand how boys need to be raised, and this is what's going to lead to you, again, not being able to help Pookie going on a downward spiral where you will be participating in doing the exact same things and expecting a different result, which is the definition of insanity. And it's an insanity to think that you that a woman can, again, raise a boy to be a man because the world works differently for boys than it does men. And because the world works differently for boys than it does men, this is why Pookie doesn't get the help that he needs because he ironically winds up pushing away the men that would help him because he's been taught by mama bad code that think, oh, men are no good because she believes men are no good and he is going to be the ultimate ideal of manhood. This is something that the single mom and the, and the beta male father allow to be taught. The boy is going to be a prince, but in this world, we men don't see any male as a prince. No, all men are the same, and again, men want respect, and if you can't respect other men, men are go going to want to deal with that male, and that's why Pookie doesn't get the help that he needs, and again, people wonder, oh, why does Pookie just keep winding up in one bad situation after the next, and again, it starts with him learning dysfunction in that single mother household, and as he learns dysfunction in that single mother household, he never learns how to function as a man. And since he doesn't learn how to function as a man, this is why Pookie winds up just falling and stumbling throughout life. He fumbles and stumbles throughout life because he was never taught how the world works for men. And he's out here and he misses out on learning what he needs to be a man because he's still trying to make the world work the way it does for women. And as he's looking to make the world work the way it works for women like Mama, he doesn't understand that the world is not going to be as nice to him as Mama. No, when it comes to the world, the world is not going to see him in the same way Mama ever would. And that's the thing that hurts Pookie the most as he goes out into the world because Mama told him he was special. Mama treated him like he was special, but the world don't treat no man like he's special. No, when the world sees a man, they see somebody that has to go out here and work hard. And again, they are expecting him to carry his weight, but Pookie don't know how to do that. And he's looking for people to help him. But sadly, when his older age, nobody's looking to carry your weight, Pookie's out here. Again, nobody's looking to carry your weight. And this is something that keeps many Pookies from learning how to get the help that they need because you need help from men to understand how the world works for men. And this is why people sit there and wonder, oh, why is Pookie stuck in the same place even though you've basically given him lots of different opportunities? I mean, opportunities all around him like college grants, opportunities even they give him jobs, opportunities are out here as related to all sorts of social and government programs, but Pookie just can't make anything work even though he's been given everything. And the irony is, is that people can't see that giving Pookie everything is why Pookie is someone who can't be helped because you gave him everything and because you gave him everything, he doesn't appreciate anything. And that's why he doesn't do anything at all because you didn't give him what he needed as related to life as a man and because he doesn't have what he has as related to life as a man, while you gave him everything material, you didn't give him a foundation in spiritual, and you didn't give him a foundation in spiritual, and because you didn't give him a foundation in spiritual, Pookie doesn't know how to be a man because a boy can't learn how to be a man from a woman. Now, if you want to learn why so many Pookies wind up on a dysfunctional road that leads to them winding up becoming dysfunctional, you can pick up my book, The Man Crisis, on Amazon.com in paperback and Kindle format. You can also find The Man Crisis at other online booksellers like Draft2Digital, Google Play, 
Barnes & Noble, and big box retailers like Walmart and Target. And if you'd like to see me make more videos about men's issues, you can send a donation to the Patreon, the PayPal, or the Cash App by clicking the links in the description box. That's all I have to say for this video. You can comment, rate, and subscribe. Now available in paperback and e-readers, John Haynes, Godbreaker. The man who rules the world takes on the Asgardian God of Thunder in this action-packed, all-new John Haynes series adventure. Get your copy of John Haynes, Godbreaker in paperback and e-readers at online booksellers everywhere. Support Black-owned and Black-operated digital broadcast media, www.niceradionetwork.com. Nice Radio Network, broadcasting 24 hours a day, 7 days a week.